Now, Marie's powers are a little bit confusing in my opinion because on surface level, she seems like a basic bloodbender from Avatar. But as you saw in the clip prior, she can actually make her blood into like a rope or a lasso. And she's also able to make and shape her blood into hard objects, into spikes, into balls. Straight up just changing it from a liquid to a solid. And we kind of see this when she heals the woman as well. Because it seems like she closed the wound in her neck by freezing the blood. So she kind of has more than blood bending. She also has kind of like Green Lantern blood powers where she's able to shape the blood into whatever she needs. And I wonder how they're going to scale her powers up because hypothetically everybody has blood in their system and she should be able to control it. So I wonder if they're going to explore that route and make her one of the most powerful soups we've seen in the show. Because since soups have blood, hypothetically, she should be able to control every one of them. But I wonder if it's like Victoria Newman's power, where if a soup has a certain level of durability, she can't use her powers. Like, will she be able to bloodbend Homelander? And obviously, the downside of her own ability is that she has to cut herself to access her own blood. But as she grows in power, this may no longer be the case. But yeah, what do you guys think about this? Let me know what you think in the comments below, and don't forget to follow for more. Peace.